today. I am Superintendent Galvan with the Greenfield Union School District reading you a story for bedtime. And today I am celebrating the Oak Avenue Brown Bears. So if you're from that school, uh, you get to be celebrated today. Every day I'm wearing a different school shirt so that we honor every one of our schools who I love so much. So today is all about Oak. Tomorrow will be another school. All right. And then I wanna tell you that today school is looking a little different, right boys and girls? So the book we're gonna to read to you is School is Different This Year, and that's okay. So I wanna read this to you because some of our children are coming back to school in certain groups, and so you might be hearing about that here in Greenfield. Hola comunidad de Greenfield, soy Supreme de Galvan, aquí con ustedes leyendo esta historia. Es la no es la hora de dormir, so gracias por estar aquí conmigo. Voy a leer esta historia que se llama Escuela. Es un poco diferente este año, y eso es los osos cafecitos para celebrar y cada día voy a celebrar una diferente escuela para um, celebrar ustedes y cuando es tu turno de estar aquí pueden poner su playera conmigo. So gracias por estar aquí uh, conmigo y vamos a leer esta historia con ustedes. So thanks for being here. School is different than year, this year and that's okay. So let's see what we learn from this story. This is written by Susan Leninger and Julie Bear. You know, it's been a nice long summer and the animals are starting to think about going back to school. It's a long summer and it's been a long first part of the year too. You know, school looks a little different this year. The students at this elementary have a few options. They can go to school in person, they can go to school online, or a little of both. All the options are okay. Families make different decisions and need to do what is best for their family. Last spring, everyone had to do remote learning because of a bad virus called COVID-19 or the coronavirus. We all know about that. This virus can make people really sick. So staying at home helps to keep everyone safe. The coronavirus is a sickness that spreads all over the world. We all stayed home, and we still are staying home, many of us, unless it is something essential, we didn't go back to work or back to school. We couldn't go out to eat. We couldn't even play baseball or dance in our ballet recitals. We even stopped visiting our grandparents. Boxes started to show up at our door. We started to wash everything and even wear a mask. Well, all of that, like wearing a mask, washing your hands and giving people space or social distancing can really help slow the spread of the virus. Lorenzo and Gracie will do remote learning this fall. Lorenzo is excited. He thought it was a lot of fun. He got to see his friends on the computer. He got to eat snacks all day long, sleep in, discover new ways to learn, and spend more time with his family. Gracie didn't like remote learning. She missed her friends and her teacher a lot. School at home was boring for her without the fun chairs, the recess, and art time. There was a lot of time on the computer doing videos, and that was hard for Gracie. She wanted to go back to school. She just wanted her mom to be her mom and not her teacher too. The GOAT family is going to school in person and that's okay too. Johnny doesn't really care which option, but he does want to play baseball again. Let's see, my page got stuck here, boys and girls. Paisley, she's worried. She heard a lot of grown-ups talking about it She's not even sure about wearing a mask and not picking her, her seat at lunch. The classrooms look really different too. Everything is so far apart. Even though things have changed, our love for our kids in Greenfield, oh, I know I added that, will never change because it's true. If you are at home, in your school, or somewhere in between, we are all in this together. And school is different this year, and that's okay. And there's the world on this last page with the big heart on it. 
So boys and girls, this is a really good story because it happens to be what's happening in Greenfield right now. Some of our kids' parents decided to send them back to school in preschool, TK, and in SDC. And some of our parents said, nope, I wanna keep my kid at home. And that's okay. School is different this year and that's okay. As Greenfield, we respect everyone's decision on what's best for their family, just like we heard in this book. So thank you for joining me today. I can't wait to read you another story tomorrow night and show you my next shirt. Have a really great night and I'm sending you a great big bear hug from our family to yours. <laughs>